not a normal adventure race. 671 kilometers of mountains, jungles, rivers, ocean, and swamp. It is brutal. This is proving one of the most unforgiving parts of the world's toughest race. This is where heroes are made. For the next eight kilometers, they must swim and trek through these bone-chilling waters where the temperature hovers at 58 degrees Fahrenheit. We're going to see teams quitting in terms of morale and just not being able to go any further. The jungle looks pretty much impenetrable. The tape leads us to here and we've got to go that way. Well, shall we get swimming? Get this over with. Oh, really? Awesome. My favourite early morning pastime. Our biggest fear at the moment is not the other teams at all, it's, it's the course. This water is absolutely freezing. We see the Spanish team clear the top of the falls. They're going to be entering this stage now. Let's hope they keep moving. Keep warm and keep strong, but this is going to reduce people. I know it. We came here to fight for the first three places. It's the first event to race that they have the feeling of arriving to a limit in my mental and physical strength. Today. <laughs> A nightmare. It's cold. We are tired. And also, we got lost. When the rain came, it was the hell. Alberta and Yuka managed to find a trail between the, the trees, the jungle. Fran was really in an uh, unhealthy state. <laughs> in that point, we didn't know, is he going to quit right now, or do we put the shelter and tarp and say, let's ask for help? <laughs> bien mojados y a los muchos horas salimos a las tres y media todos juntos me va es un marrón creo que también tienes hipotermia parar es morir let's get your kilo done listen mate listen okay you're safe just now Listen, mate, you're, you're going to okay. be okay. Okay, Fran. Okay, right. How long has he been like this? Fran. I need you to sit up for me. So there's different stages to hypothermia, and ultimately you can develop heart arrhythmias and can die. Fran, can you hear me? 